All right, y'all, we are going to be working Big Goofy. We're going to take him. He's in the truck right now. We're just going to put this coon up in a tree. See if he can tree it a time or two. Pet him up, get him excited. He's not going to see the coon. We're going to turn him loose just like we're going coon hunting. This is one of the methods that I use. I'm not coon hunting him right now. I'm just working him on this coon, locating the tree, and staying treed. I'm going to turn the coon loose and let him work the track after we get some tree time in. It's pretty late, so I like to do it about three times, but we'll just see if he locates the tree on this first one. I've only done it a few times. I've got access to more raccoons. So we can uh, repopulate our hunting grounds and work him on locating the tree and staying. Most dogs can run tracks. It's the locating the trees and staying that wins the hunts. All right, y'all, that's a little friendly. We got Big Goofy out here. We put the coon up in the tree. Walk a few steps down this path. <coughs> what are you hanging on for? No, he don't know if he's got him hooked up on the GPS yet. All right, go ahead and cut him loose. Now that we got the track. Got it. Yeah. I guess I go down with one boot and one hay dude on. I guess that's what about 200 yards. Yeah. <coughs> I don't know if he smells it or if he just, you know, he mouths a lot. Hey, look, if this thing's on country track, run down there with one hay dude and one boot on. My hand's all cramped up. Climbing that tree. Is he over by? Hell, I think he done already found it. 30 seconds. It could be that tree I first put him in. Eat him. And it's too bad. I don't find a good dog just now. Yeah, I hear him. He sure needs it. It's been a while since we had him out of the pen. Now we got more access. Yeah, he found him already. I guess he smelt him all the way back there, 200 yards. That's what we 200 yards away. Smelt him all the He sure needs a lot of work. Yeah, he already found it. Score and pet him. Yeah, when you got young dogs like this, you can't hunt too much. They don't need to see the raccoon. I mean, you need to... He don't know that he ain't go out and coon hunt. He don't have no idea that's a cage coon. Let him get on the tree. That's a big old dog, yo. We got Paul Bunyan, handler, Finley River Kennel. All right, y'all, we're going to do this another time or two, and, uh, and we're going to cut it loose.
one right there, so it's going to come out and get you. Hold on. All right, y'all. We're going to turn the cone loose and wait a little while. Are you ready, Dad? Yeah. Just flip it on its side like I always do. It'll come on out of there. Man, it's going to mess my trap up. Yeah, it tore that trap up. That's a big old cone. Come on. Come on. Come on. Give you some Just leave it alone. Okay. It'll come on out. <laughs> that ain't gonna get you, huh? All right, y'all. All right, y'all. We waited about ten minutes. Damn, Anthony. Sorry, Dad. <laughs> no, he ain't in that trap. You better go find him. He's going that way, boy. <coughs> <laughs> Put your nose down. Oh, oh. He ain't opened up, but he's going that way. He found to. You mean that cone didn't go up after all that time we waited? Hang on. Get him off, get him off, get him off. That sucker won't run nowhere. Anthony, hit the rabbit's dog. I ain't trying to get caught up again. Hey, he caught him on the ground. There he goes. Grab his tail, grab his tail. I'm trying to do Ow, why is your dog going to play with that guy too? Run. He's going to catch his tail, boy. Go on the run, dude. He ain't run, but about a hundred dollars. Hold this dog. Hold this dog. Hold this dog. Well, he picked this tree. It ain't too far from where we got the coon away from him. We're going to cut little Anna loose and see if she goes on with it. We're going to catch him. I ain't seen nothing. It's a big old cedar tree. I ain't seen nothing yet. We're gonna let little Ann loose and let her check him. That's that some bitch in there. Well, little Ann finally picked it up, worked, I don't know, finally 10 minutes around here or so. And they are on the track. So Big Goofy is uh, Ow, following is behind Little land now. Ow. We'll see if we get trees. Ow. That coon decided to run this time, y'all. We got to grunt through the jungle. <laughs> they ran and ran and ran. We up in a cedar bush. Big Goofy falls free a time or two. Grab him. We're going to see if we got him. We got frost on the ground. That's on the road. That little ant. We're going to look for him. Just time with that tree right there.
Yeah, we not seeing the coon. We not seeing him at all. So I guess that's going to conclude this training session. At least, uh, Big Goofy did catch him on the ground. That sucker ran. They ran a long ways. He did get tree with little Ann. They worked. So, got out in the woods, got a little fur in his mouth. Um, he did come on tree with little Ann. Get tree, so, pretty productive night so far. They could have missed him, and then it could be up in all them cedars. I don't know. But the dog's out in the woods hunting, getting his mind right. And the frost is on the ground, and it is late, late, late. So, until then, we'll see you on the next training session.